Hi, this is Debbie from Money for Dreams. Today I want to talk to you about vision, and in particular, my vision. And my vision stems from my work that I do with uh, parents and children facing the challenges of uh, complex disability needs. And my vision is to convert um, a public house, which sadly um, in my area there are a lot of them closing down, I'd like to convert it into a respite day centre for parents and children facing the challenges of complex disability needs. Um, my working title at the moment is uh, Debonair Den of Dreams. And where the vision came from um, actually was inspired by the, the recent summer holidays and summer holidays in the past. And, you know, the challenges faced by every parent and every child on what they should do on a day-to-day -day basis through the holidays when there's no school. And especially uh, the challenges faced by children and um, their parents who are dealing with the challenges of complex disability needs. And I just wanted to create something that would just give some kind of relief to uh, the parents and the children. And this is where the idea came from. There are some beautiful buildings that were once public houses and sadly are standing derelict, um, not being used. So this is where my vision comes from. I've given myself a, um, a target of three and a half years to get my first debonair den of dreams up and running. Um, I will be um, creating a charity and reaching out to parents and children for ideas and feedback on what they would like out of such a respite centre. That way I would be meeting the needs of um, individuals and groups of people rather than me saying, oh well I think they would like that or I think they would like that. It would be much more beneficial if they could have the things that they find useful themselves. So I would really love um, for anyone who sees this video to give me some feedback and some comments on the bottom of the video on the types of things they'd like to see in um, the Debonair Den of Dreams Respite Centre. Um, I'm looking at doing a specific room, say a sensory room, a music room, you know, whatever kind of feedback I get, I will I'll try and imp implement it to, to the full. And, you know, any other ideas that you think may be um, useful um, to get Debonair Den of Dreams up and running. Uh, first and foremost, um, I'd like to reach out to people who have started charities and how they've actually gone about it, um, as this is a, a completely new project for me. Um, but what I will do is I will keep everyone up to date with a series of videos saying how um, the project is coming along and the feedback that I've had from um, the public, from parents and from children. So I really appreciate your time watching this video and you know, keep your eyes peeled and let's see the involvement of Debonair Den of Dreams. Take care and I'll speak to you very soon. Bye for now.